Hello, here we are at 413 York Street. This is uh, in Gulf Breeze proper, um, which is a highly sought after area. Year built was 2015. It's a four bedroom, four bath, 2,742 square foot. Offer price is 999,000. Just went on the market on May 22nd. Here we are May 26th. So um, what I like about this uh, house is Number one, location, we're out here. This is a new build. It's hard to find a new build in uh, Gulf Breeze. So we'll show you the house, and then we'll kind of show you that on this exterior. Um, we got pavers going up the driveway. It's a really nice uh, curb appeal. Want you, want you to see the neighborhood. Um, what's unique here is there's also a lot of other new houses on this street. Um, just across the street, I see one, two, three, four, five houses that were probably all built within the last 10 years. Most of Gulf Breeze proper is built in the 60s, so the fact that you have all these new houses on the same street um, is unique here on York Street. So this is in an X flood zone, so no flood insurance required. Um, come on in. Insurance will be easier to get. Um, here in Florida, we're having issues with insurance right now. So the fact that this is a 2015, this would be a much easier house to insure than an older one. Um, so come on in, everything's 2015. This is a really nice home. Can't wait for you to see it. So when, as you come up, you notice you have a nice gardening, a nice sitting area, paver. Sitting area, um, great landscaping with uh, many rose bushes lower columns, uh, nice paver hardscape walkway up, um, nice hardscape all the way around to the backyard where the pool is, uh, hardscape on the front, um, sitting area where you can enjoy the afternoons or mornings with your coffee. Uh, there's a beautiful magnolia tree providing a lot of ample shade in the front. Um, as you walk up to the front door there's a lot it's a very tall ceiling I'd have to make this at least 12 feet big front door tall front door I'm five six so this thing's probably at least eight feet um, maybe nine all right let's check it out Show you and slowly pan. It's a big open, wide open front entry. Very modern, tall, 10 foot recessed to 11 foot ceilings is what I call it. All recessed lighting, all modern uh, lemon peel on the texture on the ceiling, no popcorn or anything like that. Just really nice. We're standing still at the front door, just nice wide open. You see the um, gas fireplace, the living room, um, straight out to the pool, open kitchen with a nice bar sitting, seating for plenty of ample bar seating for uncrowded four seats. Uh, gas stove over there, gas uh, stove top, nice new refrigerator. And then over here to the left is a big open dining room area that table fits six easily but it looks like there's room to make you put a bigger table beautiful chandelier um, we've got granite countertops in the kitchen beautiful granite unique and uh, the tile backsplash And then, so from this open area, we step towards the guest side of the house first. Um, no, I'm sorry. This is the master side. So as we come in, there are garage doors right here. And then there's the garage. We'll step on out in there and you'll see that you got a two car garage, both with the garage door openers and the hot water heater in the corner. Um, looks about like a 50 or 60 gallon 
and we can, um, you can tell that that's electric. There is gas and electric here. The, uh, the gas appliances are the stove and the uh, fireplace, but electric is the air condition and the hot water heater. So that air condition is nice and quiet since it is electric. Everything's from 2015, so it's only eight years old from the house was built. Again, that's unique for Gulf Breeze proper. Uh, here is your big pantry. So your kitchen's right around the corner. And then in this hallway is your big pantry with a lot of built-in shelving. This is the, as you come off, this is kind of what I would consider the guest bath. This, this uh, house has four full bathrooms, all tiled showers and all. There you, go. you come back into this uh, wood floor hallway, by the way. Um, all the wet areas are tile floor, nice tile floor, and wood floor everywhere else except in the two guest bedrooms. This is the exercise room with a closet. Nice closet with built-ins. Sliding pocket door here, probably going to the bathroom, I'd imagine. Yes, that pocket door comes to the bathroom from that uh, exercise room. Um, just off, here's the master, and just off the master is the laundry room with a countertop for folding and a sink. Tall ceilings everywhere here. Uh, recessed lighting here in the master. Unique color scheme with the blue on the ceiling. This uh, this room's big. Um, it's 16 by 15 and a half. Ample room, this is a king size bed to give you an idea. Long. Here's the master bath. Nice tile. Wood floors in here. Tile in there, that's how the house, as the house is. It's got a separate toilet room, water closet. Big uh, closet with a lot of storage in here. Big, big closet with closet organizers. And a door. Just a lot of room here. Shelves on both sides. A lot of room for uh, in the master closet. Very nice. The shower has two shower heads. It's got, well, it's got the overhead shower head, the rain shower head, and then the handle shower. Big two foot tiles. So come back out from the master bath. This is a nice court, nice uh, quartz or granite here. Really nice. Double vanity there. So we come back out. Here's the kitchen. Uh, the microwave in the uh, island. Sink. Big range hood. 
slow close cabinet, custom tall cabinets in the kitchen. Take a look at them inside. Yeah, a lot of room. Slow close. There's more seating over here on the island. This is the seating area. Back out to the pool. We'll go over here and check out the uh, guest side. Um, here's the gas fireplace with a matching backsplash to the kitchen. See, that matches that. Gas fireplace. A big crown molding here everywhere, modern crown, where it kind of bevels out. Here's the air condition running so you can hear it. Big AC closet, very modern and clean, very clean. Carrier is the brand, nice, well-known brand. Drain pipe going through the slab. Okay, Motel 8, because this is the guest side. So here's the first bedroom. Towards the front of the house. And the closet in here. Little light. Big closet. All of uh, the closets have nice storage shelving already. This room has a fan. Another uh, little hallway with another. This is a second attic access. There's attic access in the um, garage as well. To, uh, with the attic access there has stairs in the garage. Um, here is a full bath. Nice. All the bathrooms are really nice. And again, all none of them are inserts. They are all, they're all tile. This is subway tile. Full tub, custom tub. The shower head. And another guest bath, or another guest bedroom with a bathroom in it. So it's four bedrooms, two bedrooms over here, two bedrooms on the other, and a four bath. Two bedroom, you know, the master and another bedroom on the other side. So this is the walk-in closet here, walk-in closets on in all the bedrooms. All ceilings and here is the bath here now this bath with a walk-in shower tile shower big toilet area doubles as the pool bath because you got here to the backyard porch area with recessed lighting fan grill area paver deck pool with a sunning ledge and a sitting ledge around with a hot tub, water falling into the pool, nice lounging tool er, um, lounge area, garden over there, all new, all real good looking new fencing, um, kind of a little bar area with music playing out of it, all pavers here, nice um, fire pit area, big, mature, beautiful shade trees, shade is valuable in Florida, especially as the summer comes here, <laughs> 
So we'll show you this side. Sprinklers. Oh, I do know um, I read that this is on a termite bond with Florida, Florida Pest Control. All brick exterior. And uh, just on the front is hardy board. No gutters on the back here. Here's the other side. Oh, there's a pool heater. I didn't see a generator, but here's a pool heater, ran off gas. It's a double gate to bring uh, whatever you need back. Double gate here. So, it's a nice house. And go freeze proper. 2015 build, which is rare, very rare. Should really give it a good consideration. This is Andy McEwen. Reach out to me if you'd like more information about this property. Thanks for watching.